What's up guys, my name is Mr. Tag Beast, and I'm here to bring you guys another Call of Duty Black Ops 2 gameplay with commentary. Today what I have for you guys is a really good video on rush routes for Yemen, and also leave a comment down below when the video is over, telling me if you want more of these so you can improve your rushing routes, because rushing routes really is the key to getting those high scoring gameplays. Essentially when you're going for those 120 pluses, you really need to have some solid and good rushing routes, so if your rushing routes are solid, you can start the game off amazing, go ahead and get your streaks, and then you can go ahead and easily start cycling through them so first of all let me go ahead and show you the first rushing route now as you can see on your screen you should see C Dom B Dom and A Dom now you should see a one and then a white line going all the way around to the enemy spawn at A Dom and that's the first rushing route coming from C Dom now on this rushing route you want to make sure you have something such as an SMG that way if any enemies are looking back camping their spawn you can easily pick them off with the submachine gun up close outgun the enemy and think nothing of it and right here you see me pick up the swarm now, on screen again is the second rush route, and this rush route is for those balls D player that want to just hurry up and get it over with. So you want to use something such as a assault rifle, go to beat on, post up, make sure you're wearing something such as flag jacket. Flag jacket is an amazing perk, you can suck up those explosives like no other, and uh, someone throws a C4 at you, you can eat it. It's, uh, I mean, flag jacket is insane in this game, and that's why you want to use it. Now, on your, on, your, on your screen, you should see the third rushing route. Now, on this third rushing route, this rushing route is kind of a sneaky rushing route and what I like to do when I take the third rushing route is once I can see beat on I like to throw a uh, C4 and beat on and then when it says losing Bravo then I like to go ahead and detonate the C4 and once you detonate the C4 you're good you should get at least a kill or two and on Yemen people tend to flag and rush the B flag so you might get a quad you just have to time it right and that's what I love doing I love throwing those C4s on beat on now on screen again should be the fourth rushing route now this fourth rushing route is for those stealth players that just want to hurry up and get their streaks Probably the first minute or two of the game, you're going to take it slow. So what you want to do is you want to flank all the way around the enemies, and you should catch easily three to four enemies slipping. And right here, they start spawning on me by beat on. And yeah, so once you take that fourth rushing route, you should catch a few enemies slipping, sitting in their spawn, camping with LMGs, posted up, waiting on uh, your teammates to come to beat on. And that's what I tend to do on that fourth rushing route. Those are just four solid rushing routes that you guys can use. And those are rushing routes uh, should work every single time. If they don't, just come back to the video, leave me a comment, and I'll get back to you, and maybe I can uh, give you some personal advice. It just depends on what type of play style, but those are the four general rush routes you want to use on Yemen. You can get behind the enemy's faces, you can play stealth, you can go balls deep going straight to B, and then you can flank around and go to C. It just all depends. And I did not introduce the gameplay. This is 114 kills on the map Yemen using the PDW, and uh, I'm using five perks this gameplay, so I lost my smoke grenade, and I lost a second attachment for my vector, so that's why I'm I'm reloading so slow but I have my suppressor and my C4 and then I traded the smoke and the fast mag for an extra perk and that's what I like to do uh, when I'm playing on maps small such as Yemen it really gives you that extra boost you could be using toughness dexterity and in this gameplay I was using dexterity just to test it out and dexterity is a really good perk if you're a rusher if you like getting in the enemy's faces and uh, you know going balls deep in the spawn dexterity is the perk for you so thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, remember to leave a like rating down below. Our previous video didn't do so well, so I went back to the drawing board. I tried to make a better video this time around. And let me know, if you don't like the video, let me know down below in the comment section what I did wrong in the gameplay. So if we could smash 105 likes on this gameplay, took a lot of time, a lot of GFX work, Photoshop, and things of that nature. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. My name is Mr. Techies, and I am out. Peace. Let me back in I'm killing rappers I know that's a sin But I can't help it It's in my nature I'm